Hello, beautiful souls. I said in the thumbnail of the video, decluttering your life energetically, and how this could have been affecting some of your relationships, particularly for some of you. There may have been someone romantic in your life that recently disconnected, walked away, was cut out in some sense. And then, right at the end of the reading, it's almost like this new love energy comes in, interrupts the reading, and really wants to enter your life in a beautiful way. Now for some of you, that person at the end of the reading could have been the same physical person as the one prior in the reading, but in a completely energetically different state. So if it was the same person, it could have been them in their unhealed and healed state. But for many of you, this will be someone entirely different. For some of you, it could be someone that you haven't met yet. For others of you, it could be the re-entrance of someone from your past. As I say with all of my readings, these readings are only meant to connect with and confirm your own intuition. Really, it is your intuition that is the guiding compass of your life. So I said we were going to do this follow-up reading in the last one to dive deeper into that so-called new love. It's funny, the phrase that came out was get out of the way, almost like their higher self is telling anyone or anything that's been an obstacle to them entering your life to move out of the way so that they are able to fully connect with you in the physical world. Of course, I feel this happening at that very unconscious, higher self level, not necessarily something that they're consciously thinking. Although for a few of you, if this is someone from your past who was aware of someone else being in your life romantically, then maybe that was more literal and conscious that there was someone in your life that they wanted to move aside, in a sense, so that they could shoot their shot with you romantically or make some kind of an offer with you. We have the world card in the upright position. So this card, to me, speaks about a massive amount of soul expansion. I feel as though you have had to undergo a kind of initiation period. Where I'm hearing, you've not just gone through one awakening. In a sense, you've gone through several. Which we could really think of as several levels of awakening. And it's perpetual for you, just like our expansion is perpetual and never-ending. But the reason this is coming up is because this connection feels central to your soul mission in some way. Meaning, it feels like this is someone who both facilitates your soul's continuous expansion, but also someone that you are only able to attract into your life. You actually are constantly growing, evolving, and expanding. In fact, for some of you, it feels like your soul purpose is so grand, so expansive, that it necessitates this constant shifting and realignment with your highest path. From Define Muscular, type yes if you believe. 